Hi, I'm Monica Stanzi for an excellent lifestyle and no excuses not to work your abs. Today I have three tips for you for flat abs and you can get them no matter where you are in life, no matter how old you are, no matter what race, creed, it doesn't matter. No excuses. You can do it because if I can do it, you can do it too. Like I told you in my other video, I was having a belly and it didn't make much sense because I was exercising and eating right. Well now I'm vegan and I'm starting to be raw vegan since two years ago. And uh, I just feel so much better. And I think, I don't even have to think about my abs. I just have them toned and tightened every single day. Then again, I am kind of lying to you because I do think about them unconsciously. It has become a habit for me to be body conscious. Get it? But at the beginning, you're going to have to think about it. At the beginning, you're going to have to say, okay, abs in, abs in. Like I, I showed you that trick of navel to spine. You go uh, your belly button towards your, your back and that's going to really help you visualize what I mean. But the three tips are these. The first one is so important. It's from yoga. I got it from Indra Devi's book. Just uh, She's my one of my mentors, one of my main men mentor when it comes to yoga. So you have the arms up like this and then you're going to go sideways a little bit here and you come back. Then to the other side, just a little bit sideways. I don't believe in using weights. You've seen me using weights in everything, but not this. For your waist, you don't want your waist to get big or not even a muscle. So if you want a thin waist, as thin as your body, you can have it because you can have a perfect body with your genetics. That's the point. So to have a perfect waist for you, do not put weights because then you're going to, I don't know, maybe for some athletes, there are some exceptions. Like they really need to have that core super muscly and bulky. But for you, who just wants to feel good, look good, forget about weights. Do not use dumbbells and these exercises. Let's do it the yoga style. So now we do the same thing but breathing. We're going to breathe in and then we come back exhaling and the other way and exhale. You see that I'm going a little further sideways? Okay, let's do it one more time. And exhale, and one more time. It feels amazing. You see, you do three of these to each side every single day, maybe twice a day, and you'll feel amazing, and your abs are just going to appreciate you for it, and they'll become flat and defined. That's the point. And tip number two is to laugh. <laughs> really. Even if you don't feel like laughing, just laugh. In fact, I'm laughing about everything, even about problems, about challenges. Just laugh it off. And laugh, it, laughing is such a good medicine. I do believe it's the best medicine. It's healing. And guess what? It also makes your abs tighter because look at this. Ha, 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 ha. You don't want to be coughing. That would be like the negative uh, connotation of this kind of thing, this uh, exhale. And we're talking about the transversus muscle and uh, about exhaling. So laughing makes your endorphins go up, makes your flat abs look good. So laugh, just laugh. Laugh all the time, every day. I don't know how many times a day you have to laugh, but I'm just laughing all day because life is beautiful and you can have an excellent attitude. And if you do uh, start practicing being grateful, then it's going to become second nature even to have your abs in. You know what I mean? Like I said, I don't even think about it anymore because I'm just conscious of my posture because I want to be fit, thin, and happy and free for the rest of my life. I mean, since, since, since ever, I've known that I want to be fit. So it's not about the age. I'm 49, like I said in my other video. <laughs> yes, I'm going to be 50. Hey, and guess what? It is possible. So no matter how old I get, I'm still going to be fit, happy, and free. And yes, that's the point. So be happy and laugh about things. Just keep laughing. And if you don't know how to laugh, well, I don't know, have someone tickle you or tickle yourself or have, I don't know, your lover tickle you or, I don't know, read some funny book or watch comedy. Whatever makes it you laugh is good for you, okay? And the third tip I have is very, very similar. It's to exhale. I'm guilty of this as well because I'm still practicing. I'm a work in progress in everything that I'm teaching you, most of it. I mean, I've mastered some things, but others I'm really, really working on them. And, you know, sometimes it's like, I'm so excited, and I want to do this, and I want to do that, and, you know, I want to make this video, and I want to make uh, this blog post, and I want to share it in the world, and I have to send a research report, and i got to answer my emails, and the phone call. Hey, breathe. Inhale. You know how to do that, because most of us are inhaling a lot, 
and we're breathing superficially. So you need to start breathing deeply and focus on exhaling. Just uh, sometimes if you have to do it consciously, it's just uh, it's as if you were blowing out your candles. Can you see? The abs get more defined. And that's another amazing breathing technique that I just taught you. Inhale and exhale with full force. This is purifying, this is energizing, and it's amazing for your abs. So exhale, laugh a lot, and remember the exercises I showed you until it becomes second nature for you to have flat abs. Have an amazing, or make it an awesome, an amazing day, okay? Promise me that. Yes, and I'll see you here. And uh, leave your comments below. Give it a like if it resonates with you, and share with the world, okay? Let's love each other. Mwah.